Welcome. So what we're going to show you today is how you can use the Microsoft Security Compliance Toolkit to go grab your security baseline and then import it into the settings catalog and set it into. So what you would do is click download and then you'd go down and download this file, which I've already done for you. And you're going to see here right inside, you know, you've got all your different group policy objects and all that, which is great. So let's go into Intune and I'll show you how we bring this in. So inside of Group Policy Analytics, we're going to hit Import. And then we'll put in that folder path. So then under GPOs, you have all these different Group Policy objects, and we're just going to pick one. And we're going to pull in this GP report and hit Next. Next. Create. And so you'll see here is that you go in and you, you've got like, you know, six or seven of those. And they're going to come in here. And you can look at them and you're going to see these different ones have different levels of MDM support. And so what you want to do is you just want, we're just going to pick one. So we'll, let's pick this one here. And we can drill into it. And it's going to show you what settings can be migrated, which ones can't. Then we're going to click Migrate. We'll select all the settings. You'll hit Next. It tells you what items are going to come in. Let's do baseline test. We're not going to actually assign it to anybody yet, but we just want to kind of show you how it works. So you'll see here under baseline test, the next step you would have here is you would kind of go into the policy and you would look at it and let's, and you would go through and decide which one of these settings actually matter to you and if they actually fit your company. And so you'll do this rinse and repeat with all the different group policies for the baseline. Then once you've done that, then you've, built a comprehensive baseline, like so. So you'll see here, now I have a full security baseline with all of my settings. I can kind of go into them and check them out and see, do some of these settings matter? Are they good? Are they bad? And then from there, we're able to deploy a great security baseline.